On tonight's show, Plants That Kill, are they dangerous or is it just further scaremongering from the scientific community? I'm Will McAvoy and welcome to Newsnight. It's well known that plants are alive, however new evidence seems to suggest that some plant life would prefer a more carnivorous diet. Scientists have, been, have known for some time that plants feed on smaller insects and bugs. This is the case for one such plant, the Venus flytrap. To help us understand the situation, Professor Sprout of the Royal Horticultural Society joins us tonight. Is there potential for the carnivorous nature of the Venus flytrap to be bred into other plants, and is there any danger to the public? There are indeed plants in the world of a carnivorous nature. However, these reports have been largely taken out of context. They are extremely limited risk to the public. However, the mutations we have seen could lead to a problem in the future. My message to the public is to be vigilant. Now we have been sent some shocking home footage of a man being eaten by a carnivorous plant. Viewers of a weak disposition should look away now. Only time will tell how dangerous they really are and their potential impact on mankind. But for now, back to the studio. <laughs>